Hello and welcome to Stinger Games. Today I've got a video for you guys yet again about Troublemaker Stranded in Space. It's like the, what, 12th video or something? I don't know. It might be. And I have just explored, not this part, explored just about everything I was aware of. Right here, actually, there's some blocks that I uh, haven't discovered yet that I needed for my well that I have discovered they existed but not what they were yet uh, and not gotten them yet that I needed for my rocket okay so power core great uh, why did I open my steam interface that's not what I wanted Actually, how am I going to get this up anywhere? It's too heavy. Well, I guess it's a... I know it's a power core now, so... And this... I... Didn't see what it was. I guess. And that is the wrong way to even get up the ramp. So, let's try to find out what this is, because... It might be the gimbal jet, might also not be. Something in my mind is saying it's actually like uh, up here somewhere. But the map says it's not. Is it? No, yeah. No, it's small much of a wing. Is Why is that a lake? I mean, like, sure, it's in the lake. It doesn't have to be something with a lake to be in a lake oh that's the wrong vehicle but it doesn't have to be something with a lake to be in a lake but like something in the lake is usually pretty hard to get so I guess those are usually the hardest things or the most useful things but much of their wings aren't that useful Well, I guess I could better leave that for what it is. And there was another thing not here. Here. Or to be more specific, a motorcycle wheel. Which is actually pretty useful, so I'm gonna... It's kind of like the slimmer version of these wheels. So... That was the wrong button. I was like, oh, shite, it exploded. But it did not. I remembered something like this exploding every time it came up its pedestal thingy. An actual pedestal, I know, but. Or pedestal. But. It was pretty annoying still. I remember that. Oh, hey! I just found out apparently that this is a truck wheel. Slim wheel, small tilt motorcycle seat, small modular wing, unknown salvage. I'm pretty sure that is the engine, dragon engine. Didn't I find that, find that out previous time? I mean, I guess not, but let's see. One hours, nice. Uh, guess well. I guess I'll go over there and hey, chicken, which is actually purple. Oh, come on! That was not my fault. That was respawn. There is a house in New Orleans. Uh huh. Um, there should be a way to get underneath this, I think. Isn't there? To walk. I could actually go here and there. Okay. So.
do, 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 do. Oh, yep. That was a not actually a ball, a rock. was a bird once. Then it died. So I think the dragon engine was underneath. Oh there. Yep. That's gonna be a bit of an endeavor to get. But I should be able to make a little like some kind of a vehicle that can get that. Wait, I don't have a diving bell yet. So I guess I can't. Hmm. I'm guessing that might be somewhere around here. Uh, that's underneath the I'm gonna I'm gonna go back here. Is this is Magnet Island? Yep. Yeah. I don't know how I remember that name. Usually I'm really bad at remembering any type of name. So... I think that is the thing I saw on the map. This is pretty deep. Secretly that's where Subnautica plays. That's just the world of Subnautica biggest crossover ever actually not really I like I don't know if uh, Trailmaker is that big really that big of a community I mean it's, a, it's absolutely an awesome game it deserves uh, probably actually as big a community as uh, well, I don't know maybe like I don't know compared to some other games probably like I don't know, I would probably compare it to like, to, to be honest, Subnautica or Portal. That's partially because I'm just pretty biased because this is just the type of game that I play a lot, but really though, it's a great game and it deserves a good community. So, what I'm trying to do by the way, I'm gonna try to put a magnet on this thing which is not actually done like that it's here and then a magneto I then we need the green to be up and red to be down wait uh, and of course we need the 0 0.1 speed is not 0 0.2 hold position and yeah that should be everything hey I'm inside the cab well I'm not inside the cab actually what was this thing oh it's pretty big is it or is this just the normal size oh actually I forgot to nice now this is the small size whoa Okay, this does not appear to be a great vehicle for transporting lar large stuff. And I should probably actually have gotten the uh, uh, 4x8 things when I had them near me. Yeah, this is where I realized I should have taken all these other things with me. how that works and then that doesn't work like do something like this and then actually I can do that I was I thought it was gonna be like too long but it it actually isn't don't know why I thought that um mini thrusters I'll try that instead of Ah, and now is also the moment that I realized I should have had those spinning uh, servos to rotate. Because now I probably have to do it with mini thrusters, which is 
uh, frustrating. Well, it's not really that frust frustrating, but it's uh, it's more frustrating than uh, like doing it with um, with other stuff. The uh, well, other stuff actually. This is one moment in my life that I've said stuff and I actually meant stuff. And that just confused my brain. So let's see. The green needs to be up again, so I think that should be right. And the speed and the hold position and the gadgets. Electromagnet on E and the other on Q. Let's see if this holds up. I made a boat once with like uh, thrusters, but I actually made the thrusters so powerful that when I uh, went on the land, the boat could still like continue to slide so <laughs> I could like just take shortcuts over land I know right this power core is required for your spaceship spaceship okay so I've got power core hey there is something over there there is an island over there which Actually, is that the island on the map, or is that the, like some kind of, that is not the island on the map, what is, I'm not actually seeing anything over there, weird, and complaining about the power cores again, I don't give a mind, yes, I know right, great words, oh, and I fell. Which means it's probably a good idea to transition to this vehicle. And room. These are a lot of chickens. Yes! Actually that was... That wasn't specifically because uh, it was a good block, but it is a good block. This is really useful for uh, underwater vehicles. So I guess I didn't save that boat I just made, but now I have, um, actually, I, I can boost the block a bit, not much. I remember when, uh, like, uh, the transform had all kinds of, um, all kinds of uh, errors with like when the seed would be uh, on the wrong level for the vehicles like it would transform from the seat so uh, the seat would be at a certain level this the seat of the other vehicle would also be on that same level which caused some problems if you had some vehicles where the seat was lower off the ground or higher and that was kind of annoying because you couldn't prep, uh, couldn't uh, try I've got the word you couldn't transform from one to the other which was well I'm happy they solved it because transform is actually pretty useful now oh yeah and you could only save like a new thing in transform every uh, once and again because it would just like do some glitching stuff and that's annoying. Actually I should also save this ship as transformation two and there we go actually I need the car and then put the boat. Which is actually this faster than the previous one, not sure. I thought I sh could have expected having some uh, problems with the uh, 
sent for a fast because it's back so the back is pushing and then if the front goes out of the way the back takes over the front but then because uh, the back also turns along with the front the back is gonna like continue pushing the front away even if it's already in front of the front because the rotation has changed yes science so I think on Paddle Island surprisingly there are paddles these aren't actually that useful they're just hmm. they're just like things I guess and because I actually because I said earlier that I should uh, use more uh, or should get more things when I find them I think this is a decent place to start I should maybe make like a boat that actually has kind of a hmm, a boat that has a sort of a uh, container thing yeah just a container or a bowl or something and then it uh, you pick up a thing and it puts it in the bowl thing that could work pretty well Maybe if you make like a big ship like that, you can make like an oil tanker or something that like you can just collect a bunch of stuff with and then uh, unload uh, with uh, somebody else could have like a different vehicle and unload everything with that. That would be interesting, I think. I mean, of course, it's not actually something I've done yet. So, well, I mean, of course. It's <laughs> It's something I haven't done, done yet, so of course it's uh, my predictions can't be a hundred percent accurate all the time, but I think it might be interesting and probably quite function functional too. Not quite function. I think I am just going to do a bit of aquanautic aqua engineering stuff yes beautiful word so delphins because it's about what else would you put delphins on I mean yeah airplanes but I mean what would you use for wings else wings you're mad I should really have like you see how much the center of uh, actually how much the prompt is just building forward that's not good I need more weight in the back and less weight in the front and I think this is about where the video should end if I am right, I think I am. Not sure, but I think so. I'm not great at like remembering times, but I'm looking on the clock. And I think it's about a 50 minutes. So, um, I think next time I'm probably gonna do some more of this. Actually, oh, this is a flying island. That's why I can't can't see it anywhere. Um seems to be a few more things here. Ooh, something pretty deep too. And I think I'm going to try to get those ones. Uh, or well, next video then. And there's something here. Yeah, um, next video I'm going to do that. So, uh, like and subscribe and stuff. Hope to see you in the next video. And bye.